It's been a hot summer so far for the Xbox Game Pass, and it's only going to get hotter with more new games being added to the lineup in the coming month. Hi gamers, my name is Spazzles, and in this video we are covering games coming to the Xbox Game Pass in August 2022. Now, the games that I'm going to be listing are games that have been confirmed at the time of recording this video, and Xbox Game Pass loves adding more games closer to the beginning of the month. So you could consider this like a part one of August. And coming in first on our list, we have Turbo Golf Racing. Turbo Golf Racing is an arcade style sports racing game for up to eight players online. Now, just imagine Rocket League, but instead of playing football, you're playing golf. Drive, boost, jump, flip and fly your turbo powered car, slam into oversized golf balls and race your friends in an explosive dash to the finish flag. The game will feature fast paced arcade style racing as you tee off with your friends in an exhilarating new way. Jump, flip, glide, boost and dash with turbocharged cars and be the first to get your ball in the hole. Play with up to seven of your friends online in a Grand Prix style competition where you hit boost pads to charge past your rivals, take secret tunnels to outwit them and fire missiles to stop them in their tracks. Just from the sound and look of the game, it looks like Turbo Golf Racing will be pretty chaotic and fun to play. Turbo Golf Racing is set to join the Game Pass on August 4th. So moving on to our next game in the list, we have Two Point Campus. Two Point Campus is an upcoming business simulation game developed by Two Point Studios and published by Sega. It is a successor to Two Point Hospital and tasks the player to build and manage a university campus. The player must build various educational rooms such as classrooms, lecture halls and libraries as well as organising different cultural events and extracurricular activities. The player also needs to appoint staff such as lecturers, teaching assistants and janitors. In addition to maintaining the operation of the campus, the player also needs to take care of the well-being of the students. Each student also has their own specific needs, and they will either succeed, fail or drop out of school depending on how they were guided during their time in the campus. Like in Two Point Hospital, the game is set in Two Point County, and some characters from Hospital also return in campus. At the beginning of the game, the players are given a plot of land and players can freely plan out and build the campus, lay down paths and place decorations both inside and outside of the campus. The game features a sandbox mode where the players can build their school freely. Financial management remains an important gameplay pillar as constructing new buildings and maintaining the happiness of the students will all cost money. As like with Two Point Hospital, the game features a light-hearted tone and allows players to set up various exotic courses such as night school in which students study ancient literature and learn to become a medieval knight. Two Point Campus will be coming to the Xbox Game Pass on August 9th. Two Point Campus! Class is in session 2022! And last on our list of games we have Midnight Fight Express. In Midnight Fight Express, you fight your way across the city in a brutal melee that mixes old school brawlers, fast paced motion captured combat, customizable skills and challenging levels inspired by Dark Souls. The player uses fists, feet, knives, pipes, pistols, machine guns and more to wade through piles of enemies on their way to victory. In the game, you play as Babyface, a former member of the criminal underworld lured back into the life by a mysterious AI drone. Your mission against impossible odds is to fight your way across the city before sunrise and prevent a city-wide criminal takeover together. The game gets you hyped from the very beginning with its adrenaline fueled soundtrack and fast paced brutal combat. Combos can be performed with different button inputs, attacks can be countered and weapons can be picked up freely. There are a variety of enemy types ranging from brutes, bosses and weapon wielding enemies that cannot be countered. In the game, the player has a health bar, a focus bar and a rage meter. Health can be regenerated over time depending on the difficulty mode you chose to play on and the focus meter slows down time and highlights interactable objects in the level allowing you to plan your next move accordingly. Your rage builds up as you kick ass and tear through the criminal threat and once it fills up completely, you begin to move fast and deal extra damage for a short burst of time. 
Honestly, if John Wick was made into a game, this is exactly what you can hope to expect. Midnight Fight Express will be smashing its way to the Game Pass on August 23rd. Before we wrap this video up, I'd like to give a quick bonus mention to one more game coming to the Game Pass in August, and that is Immortality. The game was due to be released on the Game Pass back in July 26, but the developers at Half Mermaid announced that the team needed a bit more time to ensure the experience is as polished as possible. Immortality will now be coming to the Game Pass on August 30th. And that's it for today's video. I hope this video has been insightful for all you gamers looking for their next game to download on the Game Pass. And if you're excited about any of the titles mentioned in the video, then drop a comment down below and let me know. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like and hit the subscribe button. It really helps out the channel. And until next time, keep on gaming gamers.